Hey guys, it's Lena again. Today we're going to draw a really funny picture together. A giraffe in a car. Are you ready? Here we go. First, let's draw the giraffe. Here is a nose. These are eyes. And this is a mouth. Our giraffe is going to wear a helmet. Ta-da! Now I'm going to draw its long, long neck. Can you guess what I'm drawing here? It's the outline of the car. If you like drawing with me, press like and subscribe. Thank you. Okay, so we are done with sketching the basic shape of the car. And now let's add some details to make it look like a real car. It's quite easy actually. All you have to do is to repeat after me. Our car is going to look really cool because we are going to paint flames on it. Okay, now let's add some more lines here. Now it's high time to draw the wheels! A big circle and some smaller ones Let's draw one more wheel Here it is! Done. Hooray! We finished our drawing! And now I'm using a black felty pen to color some details of our super cool and super fast car. What is this color? 
let's draw some spots on its neck. What a cute giraffe! If you like it, press like and subscribe. Thank you! What color is its helmet? It's blue and orange. And let's use some orange color here and there. Oh, and do you remember that there are flames on our car? And orange color is just what we need for them. Isn't it cool? Oh, I love it! How about you? We did it! Okay, what's next? used this color before, do you remember? What color is it? It's blue. You know, I like the way these blue and orange colors work together. So here is a blue and orange car and our giraffe is wearing a blue and orange helmet. Lovely and pretty soon we are going to color the wheels. What color do you think would look best? is so bright and cheerful. It makes me really happy. Do you like purple? Then press like and subscribe. This car looks amazing. Yellow color too. Looks nice. Guys, that was fun. Thank you for joining me today. I can't wait to see what we'll create next time. Hi friends! Lina is here! Today I'm going to draw this beautiful fish! Let's draw and paint together! So here we go! First I'm going to draw the eyes. Mm, hello! Now the mouth. And I want to add some more details like these stripes on the tail. And the fins. This will help me to make the fish look more realistic. Perfect! I love it! And now let's draw the bottom of the ocean. There will be seaweeds of all kinds. 
right. And don't forget to draw corals too. Exactly. Can you see all these funny little fish swimming by while I'm drawing corals and seaweeds? They look lovely. Oh, and who's there? Hello, Mr. Crab. Do you like my picture? Just a few more touches and we are ready to add some color here. Okay, so what color am I using for the fish? Right, it's orange. Remember to be careful when coloring inside the lines. Mm, by the way, if you like our fish, press like and subscribe. Thank you! Okay, we've finished coloring its tail. You are doing such a great job. Keep it up. Oh, wow. Do you know the name of this sea creature? It's a starfish. <laughs> it looks so happy. Bye. <laughs> and we continue coloring our fish. Slowly and carefully. You know, I've noticed that it keeps its eyes closed while they are painting. Maybe it is sleeping? Oh, no, it's awake. Oh, there is another sea animal here. Do you know what it is? It's a blue seahorse. Wow! There are so many beautiful sea creatures! You know what? I've decided to use some more colors for our fish. Can you tell me what color we are using next? This color is called beige. Be careful, little fish. I'm coloring your eyes now. That's it. Oh, who is swimming there? It's a turtle. Hello. To use another color. What color is it? If you know this color, press like and subscribe. It's red. Our fish looks like it's ready to swim away. And now we need to color in the background. What color is it? I love how this shade of blue makes the water look so deep. And let's choose a nice color for the rocks. Do you know this color? It's turquoise. This color looks great for the rock. is purple. You know, I like how the colors in this picture work together so well. Some more purple here. Fantastic. color before. What's this? Yeah, turquoise. And 
let's add some light shade of pink here and there. This is so cute, isn't it? Tell me, what color is this in my picture? I'm coloring the seaweed. But you know, it also can be this color. What is it? Yes, it's blue. Blue and green seaweed. Coloring the coral now. It will be red. It's so bright. And what color is it? Yellow. As for this coral, it will be pink. Do you like this shade of pink? Personally, I think it's beautiful. But if you want to make our coral brighter, you can use some red color too. If you like drawing and coloring, press like and subscribe. Now let's color the seaweeds and the corals on the other side. We'll use, yes, yellow and bright red. And we've used this color before too. What is it? You are right, it is green. is this type of seaweed. Remember? It's blue! Awesome! Let's use some brown for the sand at the bottom of the ocean. Brush while coloring. You should be extra careful here. Good job. We are almost done, you know. Our picture looks so bright and colorful. Much fun! I really love drawing and painting. How about you? I hope you are having fun too. Don't forget to press like and subscribe. And here it is, a wonderful picture that we created together. Thanks for joining me today. Hello, I'm Lina. How about drawing a unicorn together? Repeat after me. I'm sure it will be fun. Look, we are drawing the unicorn's head at the moment. Can you see its small ear and its mane? Now it's time to draw a horn. Ta-da! And another ear. Perfect! 
Okay, what else? Eyes and a muzzle. Hello, baby unicorn. You are such a cutie. We're doing such a great job. Let's continue and draw its body. Don't forget to draw legs and hooves. Our unicorn is going to be amazing when we add some color. If you like drawing and painting, press like and subscribe. Thank you. What a beautiful tail! And we have finished drawing our unicorn! Hooray! You know, I've decided to draw one more thing. A magic fountain! Come on, join me. It will be easy, I promise. All you have to do is to draw some lines like this. Then add some more details. Done! Awesome! Now it's time to add some color. Hey, what color is it? It's blue. Perfect for coloring butter. And pretty soon we are going to color the fountain itself. What color do you think would look best? Hmm, how about this one? Do you know what color it is? It's brown. I think it's nice. Remember to be careful. Try to color within the lines. Well done. Right, one more color. What is it? It's beige. I think our fountain is lovely. If you agree, press like and subscribe. Guys, our magic fountain is finished. Wow, just look at this and there's a fish. Time to color our baby unicorn. It's going to be pink. A perfect color for unicorns. Just look at our unicorn. Smiling. Eyes closed. I guess it loves pink color too. Am I right, baby unicorn? else can be pink beautiful flowers sunsets and strawberry ice cream is pink too this color is so cheerful it makes me happy you know I think pink is one of my favorite colors how about you What's your favorite color? Now let's color the unicorn's mane and tail. What color is it? Of course, it's blue. We've used it before, remember? And what color is it? It's purple! I like how these colors work together. Beautiful! Let's add some bright color now. What is it? It's yellow! Oh wow, so warm, like a sunshine! 
If you are having fun now, press like and subscribe. We have almost finished coloring our unicorn. What color do you think we are going to use next? Any ideas? Let's see. What color is it? Yes, it's red. Ah, oh, what a cute colorful mane. And the tail is colorful too. to use for the hooves. How about red? Do you like it? What a wonderful unicorn! Thanks for joining me today, friends! See you! Lina and I love drawing. How about you? Let's draw together. I'm sure it will be fun. Here we go. Okay, what can we start with? I know, let's draw a circle. Mm -hmm, right. Do you have any ideas what it will be? I'll give you a hint. This is a handle. Okay, I'll tell you. It's a cup. Now let's draw a bigger circle for a plate. Good job! And what can we put on our plate? How about some fruit and berries? Do you know what I'm drawing here? These are cherries! Look yummy, don't they? And a nice leaf! Ah, beautiful! Alright, we got cherries. And now, let's draw some grapes. Come on, repeat after me! Yum, yum, yummy! If you like grapes, press like and subscribe! Fantastic! Now let's add some lines for the leaves. It's time to draw a slice of orange. Mm -hmm, just like this. Is it sour or sweet? <laughs> Sometimes oranges can be sour. Very good! Now let's draw something more sweeter. How about a slice of watermelon? Mm, I love watermelons! Sweet and juicy. Now let's add some seeds. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six seeds. And now I want to draw a spoon. Follow me. Finished our drawing! Now it's time to add some color! What color is it? It's green! What a bright color! Easy, easy! Try to color within the line.
all are the inside of the cup. Do you know the name of this color? I'll tell you. It is turquoise. It's beautiful, isn't it? the cherries. What color is it? Yeah, it's red. And what color can we use for the leaf? Green, of course. What a nice green leaf. And cute red cherries. Hey guys, do you like red color? Then press like and subscribe. We've finished coloring the cherries. It's time to color the grapes. And what color am I using here? Purple. Do you know that grapes can be also green? Which do you like best? Green grapes or purple grapes? Personally, I prefer purple grapes. Purple grapes. Tasty. Let's color the leaves. We've used this color before, remember? Yes, it's green. I'll take a darker shade here. Dark green. How about coloring a slice of orange now? What color am I using? Orange, of course. It's an orange orange. Mm, perfect. Let's take some yellow color too. This color reminds me of a beautiful summer day. Oh, that looks amazing! Okay, and what color is our watermelon? Right, it's red! color is it? Green! Just like our cup and the leaves. You know what? I've decided to make our plate colorful. I'm going to use four different colors. Number one is blue. What else can be blue? can be blue. The sea can be blue. This color is so calming, isn't it? Press like and subscribe if you like coloring with me. Thank you. trying to be really careful now. I'm coloring all around our fruit. This colorful fruit looks so bright on our blue plate. Lovely cherries. Yummy grapes. Juicy orange. And sweet watermelon. Which one is your favorite? And what other fruit do you like? Fruits are great. They're very tasty. And they're very good for our health too. Personally, I try to eat some fruit every day.
Let's continue coloring our plate and use another color for this part. Do you remember what color it is? Yeah, it's orange. We've used it before, remember? And our color number three is... Purple! Now look at our plate. What fruit is purple here? Grapes, right! Good job! Oh, and now something new. Do you know what color it is? It's pink! If you like pink, press like and subscribe. And what color are we using for our spoon? Yes, it's bright yellow. And green for the handle. Do you know what it is? It's a teapot. Let's fill our cup with some orange tea. And there we have it! A beautiful masterpiece that we created together! Press like and subscribe if you like coloring with me!